All righty, folks. We're going to get ready to watch the watch the uh, weather here in a few minutes. In 2021, more than a third of high schoolers reported poor mental health. 44 percent reported they often felt sad or hopeless. Additionally, oh. more than half reported they experienced That's emotional sad. abuse by a parent or other adult. But it'll be on. Uh, it'll be on here in a second. Physical abuse by a parent or other adult at home, and more than a quarter reported. So a give me a, just a second because it'll be on here in a minute. Findings also show that a sense of being cared for at school. But anyway, how you guys are doing well, man. Effect. In southern Indiana, a man who spent more than a month in the hospital with COVID returned to thank the ICU staff that saved his life. Marcus Daniels spent 36 days at Baptist Hill Floyd. Good Lord, that's a long time. And look how, well, Earlier today, we can't say anything about that, can we? Doctors, nurses, and staff. He said he wouldn't have been able to return to work or enjoy life again without their care. The TSA says okay. security screeners found guns and carry-on baggage at all five of Tennessee's major airports last week. The travelers Ooh. faced criminal and civil charges for bringing the prohibited items to a security checkpoint. Well, that's not good. The TSA says <laughs> guns can only be brought on a commercial aircraft if they are unloaded, packed in a locked, hard-sided case, and placed in checked baggage. Firefighters are working to control ah. a wildfire near the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. That spread Ooh, look at that. The fire started in the Wears Valley community of Sevier County yesterday morning as a brush fire. Sevier County Mayor Larry Waters said this morning the fire is more than 3,700 acres and impacting more than 100 buildings. Here we go, y'all. All right, let's check that out. Tonight with an update on this video we showed you last night. If you maybe went to bed early and missed the 10 o'clock news, I wanted to explain it to you one more time. So what you're looking at here is actually what's called a beaver tail cloud. This is from last night. We got this video in from Kansas oh, yeah. City. And actually, Look at this that. is what's an inflow into a wall cloud. So remember what I just showed yep. you here, that little video. What you're looking at is really this right here. It's not actually a funnel cloud. This right here is the wall cloud. That video we just had from Calvert City last night is this lower portion right here. Yep, beaver tail. Which indicates warm, moist air, kind of a tail into the wall cloud. Yep. Should a tornado have actually been forming, it would have formed right here, straight vertically down, not oriented on a 45 degree angle like that. So a little update for you on that image we had last night that came in from those storms. Here's the notable Okay, I'll get, get it over here cold. to you for a second. Temperatures will be down there freezing in most locations. All right, y'all. Saturday we're going to have some showers, but it's not too much of a big deal. Tuesday next All right. week brings a better chance of rain to the entire area. Different scene right now than this time yesterday. We took about four power hits at the station. The camera for pretty shaking, pretty good. I'll give you that for a few minutes this time last night. Much quieter, but cloudy and gloomy so. on this Thursday evening. It's 46 in Paducah, 48 in Union City, 45 right now in Mayfield. Lower 40s in Illinois and Missouri. Little reality check for you. It's still March, even though it's only a couple more hours of March. It still can get chilly, and we can have frost. Well, yeah, you can have frost. Well. I'll it's get it. The first half of April. I'll get it here in a second. When this is will be above freezing in Kentucky and Tennessee. I'm gonna hand that to However, you. However, Illinois and Missouri will be near freezing, actually what, below what freezing. You got? I think once you get out closer to Farmington, <laughs> and once you start getting up in elevation, okay. you know. When this gets, I'll get your uh, trash can for you. Going up into the Ozarks, temperatures could be near 30 or even lower than that. Ooh. Notice uh, the winter alerts we've got in effect tonight. A frost advisory for northwest Tennessee in the Missouri boot heel. A freeze warning in the purple. Ooh. If you do have sensitive vegetation, you hopefully should be protecting it or covering it because tonight, again, especially these areas shaded in purple, Cape, Points West, Ooh, look at Jackson, that. up to Fredericktown, Greenville, Puxico, Dexter, could be near freezing by tomorrow morning. Winds are still blowing out of the west, up to 15 or so miles an hour. That's not really doing us any But this favor. is the last that day of the month, so the night we made it through March. A few light raindrops coming into Pemiscot, Duncan County is here, Lake County as well. That will continue through the overnight. And notice a little burst of rain here in Jonesboro. That's going to take the long trek eastward across I-40 through the Volunteer State tonight. So here's how things look hour by hour. Temperatures are in the 40s right now. It's gloomy couple of raindrops. The clouds should clear after midnight, which is what allows the temperatures to go down near freezing. Yep. Here's early tomorrow morning. Notice, unlike today, lots of sunshine, a slight northerly breeze tomorrow. The wind should go calm by the afternoon. Highs on your Friday in the mid-50s, so it's a pretty good day to close out the week. Not You're not welcome in April, by the way, tonight at Local 610. We'll peek ahead to the April outlook, which is going to be very interesting. I think the first 10 days or so will be pretty quiet 
in terms of big weather events around here. But for your Saturday, though, the 2nd of April, we've got clouds and showers. So if you had plans to work outside, do some errands, maybe try to golf or any outdoor activities, it will be a wet start. Here's 9 o'clock Saturday. We've got rain, light to moderate, scattered across the area with temperatures in the 40s. It won't actually, uh, it's not going to feel very nice with showers in 40s, but the rain will be short-lived really during the morning. Here's 3 o'clock. Notice we start to get some sunshine in through here. Should the sun come in sooner, we could get a brief little downpour in Southern Illinois from one of those showers. But by and large, once the sunset time comes around Saturday, I think we should be uh, pretty clear as we head into early Sunday morning. So here's how the seven-day forecast looks tonight. Tomorrow, clear, 59, a northwest wind, 5 that ain't gonna be too miles bad. an hour, but calming down in the afternoon. Saturday shows morning showers. Afternoon clearing, 64, 66, nice on Sunday. That's your pick of the weekend. Partly cloudy on Monday. Tuesday, there will be rain and some thunder showers. Some of those thunder showers or storms could be strong, but I do not foresee severe weather next Tuesday. Lingering showers next Wednesday, then things should clear back out the end of next week. All right, y'all. I'll see y'all outside. Wacky Weatherman. Hey, y'all. Wacky Weatherman here. Let's go out here and check it out. Go on. <laughs> Freaking things. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm actually using the Note 9 here. One of them. Um, so, yeah, it really is a nice camera still, isn't it? Of course it is. Uh, Gerald, it is. And here is the Samsung. Here's the uh, A0, A02S. They actually got the A03S now. Um, it's, it's about the same as this. It's not really anything different. Okay. Just an A03S. Um, but this is A02S. Like I said, big old. That's the uh, one I got for 50 bucks. Incredible, isn't it? <laughs> really is. Um, so, yep. But anyway, uh, wacky weatherman here. I'm just coming in here to y'all, just saying what is happening with you people. Um, like I said, we might have some storms next week, but for the most part, everything is. Everything looks groovy. I wish I could turn that stupid. That, that dang um, image stabilization crap off. I do not like it. It's, it messes me up. Um, let's zoom in here. Okay, like I said, it's not too bad. But, <clears throat> but anyway, um, yeah, I use the, uh, I use the, uh, volume up and down buttons to zoom in and out Woo, nice huh um <coughs> so yeah it ain't do it's not doing anything y'all okay uh why would it be it's cloudy and boring and just nothing man it hasn't really been doing anything here <laughs> um i guess we're just lucky i guess um there's the wind um so yeah, this is a 128 gigabyte phone. But let us take our little stroll around. Uh, good lord, that, that, one, that one's a little cold. Whew, man. Okay. So, you know, we're just walking around. We're just walking around. <clears throat> right here. Walking around, walking around. Okay. Um, yep. You ever get tired of seeing that? Oh, I don't. Here. Listen to the blackbirds. I don't know if y'all can hear the blackbirds or not. It's kind of sprinkling just a little bit. I felt a few drops. Ah. <sighs> yep. Yeah, it's, yeah it's sprinkling just a little bit. Yeah, they're over there too. I'm still trying to find that stupid Note 10 Plus. I don't know where. I don't know where in the world that thing went to. It's in. <clears throat> it's in my room somewhere. I, it's been my. It's been months. I guess it's been since the first part of December since I seen that big old Note 10 Plus. It's been a long, long time. <laughs> I haven't seen it. I even looked at my place. I even looked over at my over at my place, over in Dongola, and it's not there. Woo, here we are. 
See, I don't know where that darn phone went to, y'all. Big old Nook 10 Plus, man. I can't even find it nowhere. It's got the ultra wide angle. I can't find it. It's like, mm. <laughs> if I could find it, I'd use the darn thing. Um, yeah, so y'all, man. But anyhow, that is uh, all there is to that. Uh, I guess it's kind of raining a little bit, starting to sprinkle just a little bit more. But hey, man! But thanks for hanging out here with us today a little bit, y'all. Uh, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. We may come back. Uh, yeah, let's come back about ten o'clock. Also, I won't upload this until eventually later. But hey, who knows? I may just upload this now. I may do another video later. <laughs> so, yeah, nothing out here. <clears throat> <clears throat> nothing out here. So, yep, wacky, wacky weatherman. That's me. That's y'all too. Y'all are my wacky. Y'all my wacky weather freaks. Weather freaks, man. <clears throat> um, I tell you what, I'll be so glad when this, when we get 90 degree weather, because <clears throat> I can handle whole, I can handle hot weather a whole lot better than I can cold weather. I got sick one time, <clears throat> but um, yep. So uh, yeah, there's nothing else happening out here, y'all. Tell you what, man, we've been doing a lot of videos up out here, huh? <clears throat> And probably going to be for some time to come. Um, but March 31st, 2022, your old buddy, your old wacky weatherman. Tomorrow night we'll do a pick and grin. And on Twitch. And that'll be groovy. And uh, hey, whatever. Whatever we want to do, man. Um, get some axes. And who knows, I might actually pick up some more uh, guitarded strings. And. Uh, string some more instruments up um but yeah but hey y'all that's it um i actually actually i really thought about getting getting a replacement a tuner for that big old six string bass i got and maybe do a do a lesson on that thing from my man jumping james <laughs> that'll be awesome all right y'all wacky weather man here Mar march 31st 2022 you guys be groovy and uh hey we'll come back out here at night and and uh, I'll go upload this video right now. Well, I need to upload the other two from yesterday and the day before. And, um, yeah. Yeah, that's right. That's what it is. Yeah, that's what it is. Y'all say groovy. Wacky weatherman here, your old buddy Gerald. Almost three years. Three years of doing this crap. <laughs> and I love it. So, that's it. You guys be groovy. And I'll see you guys tonight for another nighttime uh, wacky weather man thing. All right, y'all. You guys be groovy, and uh, you guys stay groovy. Wacky weather man. March thirty first, twenty twenty two, nineteen fifty seven. All right. <laughs>